Hello and welcome back to Magic Cat Security Pen Testing Tutorials. I had a request from a subscriber to show how to do a couple of tweaks within Parrot Security. And this will actually work just fine as long as you're running. Uh, it will work with other window managers also, but I'm going to show you how to do it with Mate, which is the default window manager with Parrot Security. So first I'm going to go over how to change or move the window controls. Now what I'm talking about there is if I open a window, you see I have the close and minimize and maximize over here, right? And then sometimes there'll be like an info thing like that over there. Okay. But suppose we don't want that. Okay. Suppose we, we want them the other way around. Well, here's how you change that. You go to your menu, however you have your parent menu set up, system, and then we'll just open Control Center, go to Look and Feel, okay, that'll bring it to the right area right away. Mate Tweak is where we want to go. Click on that, and if you go to Panel, see you have all kinds of different things you can modernize, but what we're interested in is Windows because the windows are what we're wanting to customize. Right here, parents, window control placement, left or right. If I go right, boom, see, they change sides. And if I go left, boom, they change sides. I happen to like mine on the left, so I'm gonna leave them there. But that's how we do that, okay? Now, the second tweak I'm gonna show you, um, I've had several people ask me about this actually, how I have this little uh, panel at the bottom and I'm going to show you basically what I'm talking about here so you see it's giving me my, my buttons for my windows as I go I can open up other stuff and it will be there see so and they want to know how I'm doing that so I'm going to show you right now um, by default Parrot Security is going to give you a top panel which is this one up here okay and a bottom panel. But I customized both panels, okay? Let me show you how I did that. Now, first of all, I removed all of the items or icons from the panel, all the little widgets. You just right click it and you can do tell to remove it. Like if I wanted to remove this, I don't, but let's say remove from panel, okay? And we even have the switchable workplaces up here, and then by default, um, Parrot puts it down at the bottom. So I take all those icons and such off. I'm gonna right click here, so I get properties for my panel, okay? And here's what I'm doing, I'm gonna show you. Um, that's what your panel looks like with no decorations on it, normally. And all I'm doing is I'm telling it to auto hide and I tell it not to expand. So it stays as small as it can be and it expands automatically with however many buttons are down there. You can change the size, whatever, in the background if you want to, that sort of thing. You can even make it transparent or put an image for the background. But that's what I do and that's what this is. Now, how to make sure I have the little buttons down there. It should already be set up for this. But if you have to do a new panel or whatever, add to panel, okay? And these are the little widgets that you add to your panel. If you go all the way down to the bottom. Now, the workplace switcher is what you see up here at the top. See, and I have it at the top right-hand side. That's what I have up there, okay? And that's what changes my, my workspaces. However, if you see the window selector, okay, um, we have some different options there. And then you have window list. Um, using buttons is what you want, okay? Um, and that's exactly what that is. When you open a window, it gives you a button there, okay? So that's what you want to add if you lose it, but it should have it automatically or by default when you install Parrot in the bottom panel. But just, just wanted to show you how to re-add that in case you have to delete that panel or you accidentally delete it and need to recreate the panel down here. That's how you do that. 
um, you can add as many panels as you want wherever you want okay a uh, new panel and it threw me a panel over here and I can move it over to the left if I want I can make this one bigger I can go to properties I can say all right let's make the panel much larger I'm gonna go like this and I'm gonna tell it not to expand so then I can add whatever icons I want to it and you have sort of uh, the idea is you got your Ubuntu like look there and like I said you can change whatever side it's on and stuff like that and, but I'm gonna remove delete that panel but anyway that's your two little tweaks for um, using mate and uh, paired security um, it should work within the uh, mate installation on a Linux distro but that should help you out thank you very much have a great day